the STS-128 flight is going to complete the final uh, outfitting of the station with its uh, major research facilities. This is the last leg of the construction phase for us now. Uh, our attention is turning to deploying the final research facilities over the next several uh, logistics flights so that when the assembly is completed we're ready to uh, get into the full ramp up of continuous use of the space station. The assembly phase has been awesome. Uh, over a hundred thousand people working around the world to complete the construction of the facility. U.S. contractors in 37 states and by the time we're done uh, the International Space Station is going to be almost 900,000 pounds, almost 500 metric tons. Uh, now we're looking at, at using that space station aggressively. If we look back over the history of spaceflight, a lot of the research that has been done has been largely anecdotal. There were uh, brief opportunities to conduct research in space on seven to ten day missions. Now for the first time in history, we'll be able to take some of those more interesting anecdotal results that have been collected over the last few decades and focus in on them in order to pursue focused investigations that have repeated and consistent flight opportunities. We're at the very frontier of an entirely new environment that people have not had the opportunity and the access to use continuously. So we really are literally on the cusp.